There is a jungle right in the middle of Europe. This jungle is not a nature reserve, nor is it the habitat of wild beasts. Its inhabitants are over 2,000 men, women and children. Upon entering the jungle, I encountered a young boy. How old are you? 11. Where are you from? Afghanistan. Do you live here? Yeah. He showed me little Afghanistan. There were grocery stores, restaurants, even a makeshift mosque. No. One small boy is Afghan, uh, one. Okay. Introduced me to one of his friends, an assistant director of a construction company in Afghanistan. Right next to Afghanistan was Little Sudan. I was invited to lunch cooked by a professional chef who used to work for a large German corporation. There I met an economist who used to work on his father's farm. I have comments, I have cows, I have sheep, many things. We grow it, simsim, dura, mm. same like this place. Exactly in this time, huh? in this month, so it's nice there. Even I don't like to come here, but when the government come to take uh, little land from me, Mm -hmm. Because I am on border. I'm in south and another in the north. Mm -hmm. Four is one country. The government from uh, south come to take, and uh, from north also come to take, and we're fighting with them. I don't know fight to who. Government from north or government from south. Mm. About that, I'm running. The economist then introduced me to a young student from the war zone in Ukraine who told me about his attempts to jump the trains to the UK. Они просто пытаются залезть на этот поезд, но они не все знают, что даже если ты попал на этот поезд, сверху где-то метр от крыши поезда есть оголённые провода электричества. Вот. И то есть когда они залазят на поезд, становятся на крышу. Mm. Uh, было очень много случаев. За тот момент, который я здесь, я слышал около шести персон, которые умерли только от оголенных проводов. Потому что они... И ты стоя... здесь uh, один месяц, да? Uh, я здесь один месяц и две недели. Uh -huh. да. to go to England only for a job like here I travel a lot of countries but no job is not available people say you can go to England you can find a job but we go to England only for jobs why because in our countries we are suffering we have kids wives and families so we want to send money to them for their education for their good future mm. if you work here then we can send money to our families if we cannot work even we cannot survive ourselves Mm. And we are here not only for ourselves, we can eat and drink everywhere for our for survival. But the main important is for our family and the education, like everyone wants to give good education to their kids. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I work for a ferry company and um, last uh, winter in December it was really cold and I saw many women and kids um, and I saw them walking in, in the, the snow, the rain, and I, I thought I must do something for them, I'm, I must try to help. So I started to collect uh, clothes and then food, 
I started to give them and then I tried to find um, someone to introduce me uh, to people in the jungle. Yeah. And, um, I found a woman who works in an association and she, she helped me to come here, she yeah. introduced me to people. And then I met friends, we started building shelters and stuff yeah. like that. This afternoon I just met three girls from uh, Eritrea yeah. and um, one is pregnant and now we are friends, we changed the phone number so they can give me news because they are trying now, they are trying to pass to England. So we try to keep a contact, I don't know, it's very... It's not a normal contact, you know, when um, you meet people here, you have... Uh, the feelings are different, I don't know, I can't explain that. Mm. Just different, very strong feeling. My friends, yeah, yeah, only on this uh, place because my friends, all of you got to England because my uh, this girl uh, very difficult in uh, train, yeah, uh, only boys by uh, by force in. Uh, so the boys, the boys, uh, escaping, escaping in jump, jump, this is okay. uh, penis, this yeah. penis. Uh, six penis, yeah. jump, 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 uh, that's why you jump, jump, Okay. Uh, go to in a uh, train. Yeah. Because me, <laughs> okay. very difficult, this uh, penis. What does it mean to live a good life in Europe? Does living a good life not require a social and ethical conscience? Maybe a social conscience is even a prerequisite to leading a good life. <laughs> 